welcome to the Movie Movie Game. Woohoo! How are you doing today? I am doing fantastic. This is exciting. I love a game show. Uh, holding it together at the moment. You know, I, I've gone into every category thinking, oh, this is the category that's going to break me, and none of them have, so... So I think I'm gonna I'm gonna rock this. You're a son of a bitch. Let's do it. <laughs> Fast and the Furious James Bond type secret agent with ripple tastic muscles is invited to his eccentric CEO's home to administer the Turing test to a technologically impressive and kind of hot android robot. What? Okay. Okay. Um, oh, honestly, like I feel like I just blacked out. A muscly. James Bond? Not James Bond, not Fast and the Furious. It's something with The Rock. Is that uh, Hobbs and Shaw? Oh, is it, um, oh, what's his name? The other guy from Hobbs and Shaw. I, I'm trying to figure, I'm trying to remember who else besides The Rock. Almost like a garbage version of a spy hero. Vin Diesel? Yes! Oh wait, oh, Vin Diesel. Vin Diesel doesn't have ripple-tastic muscles. Oh, Vin Diesel's in the movie? He's just a big, he's just big, he's just a big guy. Um. Uh, let's College see. shots on Vin Diesel. <laughs> so, yeah, Vin Diesel, stop. Vin Diesel movies. Out of the gate. Pitch Black. It's not Bloodshot. It's not Chronicles of Riddick. That's all I got. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Triple X. Yes! Or is it Quadruple X? Like, the X's, they, they were always presented in a font so that I couldn't tell them how many X's were actually there. Oh, that's the one where the robot, the AI robot, yeah, you know it. What is it? Uh, well, you give it a go. I don't know the names of it, but I know the, <laughs> yeah, he sits with the robot and then like falls in love with her. Do you know the first one? Absolutely not. Uh, <laughs> well, the second it? one is Ex Machina. Ex Machina, okay. Well, and the first one was... Oh, wait, is it, um... Fast and the Furious. Close. <laughs> With a little bit more of like a stutter, like three stutters yeah. specifically. F -f -f fast and well, like, f -f 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 furious. <laughs> imagine, imagine that you know the second title. Ex Machina, yeah. But you something. can't quite get it out. You're getting hung up on it because you get so excited about Ex Machina that the X, first X, syllable. X, triple X Machina. Yeah, she got it! Yeah. <laughs> Triple X. Yes! Triple X Machina. Yeah, you got it! <laughs> triple X Machina. Yes! Or, as I like to call it, Triple X Machina. Triple X Machina. I have never seen Triple X. Triple, triple X, X Machina. Machina. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah! Got it! <laughs> triple X Machina. You son of a bitch, <laughs> yes it is. <laughs> Yeah! No one's gonna remember Triple X. <laughs> do, do people remember that? Honestly, when I put these ones together, I was like, the Willems are gonna slay it. They're gonna make it so we, you know, We don't have much else going on, Joe. We are just watching things. Things old and things new. It's Shakespeare's Taming of the Shrew. Set in a high school with a future Batman villain as a hunky love interest who also turns around a struggling television station with hit programs like Conan the Librarian and Wheel of Fish. Joe, sometimes when you talk, it's like <laughs> no word relates to the next. Like, that's kind of the point of the game, I guess. You know, that's the beauty of it. What's the second one? Okay, well, let's think. Let's hold on. Wheel of Fish. If there's anything I know, it's Batman villains. I think I've seen the, I think I've seen all the Batman movies. I gotta hone in there and then work my way back. Oh, okay. I know ten things I hate about you. Okay, Arnold Schwarzenegger. Okay, so that's ten things I hate about you. Jack Nicholson. A struggling television station. Hold on. How? So the first one, Heath Ledger. Yeah, babe. Ten things I hate about. What's that movie with Jack Black about rewinding stuff? Give Give me the whole thing again. Or at least it's give me no. Don't you know what? Shit. Don't give me the whole thing again, and don't talk to me about Shakespeare. <laughs> you know, after all you're learning about me today, you think I don't, you, you think you can throw a Shakespeare reference around? You weren't watching movies or playing with toys, so you must have been reading, reading Shakespeare, Shakespeare, right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, I mean, you give me too much credit. I told you I was staring at GI Joes and listening to music, man. What's this? 
What is this movie? Oh no, I think this is gonna be the st uh, 10 things I hate about. What's the second one? I don't, I thought, I mean, I thought the second one was different, but I don't know how it fits at all. How about this? It's a, it's an acronym mm. for ultra high frequency. Uh... King of parodies, only movie. I don't know. The fact that I even figured out how to record this is a marvel. <laughs> I don't know technology. What do you think the second one is? I thought the second one was UHF. Ten, what do you think the first one is? Oh. Teeth Ledger? No. Ten so, thing. Got it. Okay. I was I was doing How to Lose a Guy in 10 Days <laughs> as opposed to uh, 10 Things, I hate, ten about things I hate About UHF. 10 Things I Hate About UHF. Yeah! Yeah! Thank you, baby. Nice job. H, wait, ultra high frequency, UHF? Is it 10 things I hate about UHF? Yeah. <laughs> 10 things I hate about. Uh, 10 things I hate about UHF. UHF. There you go. <laughs> so you got 10 them. things I hate about UHF. Yeah, you got it all by yourself. No help whatsoever according to the edit. We're good. So we're talking UHF. I should put this together. 10 things I hate about UHF. You knew the movie! Yes! <laughs> yeah, that's great. Have, Have you seen, seen UHF? You, you know, the first um, cassette tape I ever owned uh, was is Weird Al. And uh, he, he played a pivotal role in, in my life. And it was a pleasure to meet him. We had him on GMM's. Coolest wow. guy ever. <laughs> I love that we got UHF in there. That's so great. So many people are going to love that UHF is included in here. No one talks about UHF enough. Uh, I didn't tell him, but I'm going to tell you I've not seen UHF. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't know what's wrong with me, man. Here we go. <clears throat> Tina, you fat lard, come get some dinner and then meet me at the talent show where I'll show you my sweet hockey skills and bust out my flying V. Okay, so... Okay, is it... Okay, hold on. Tina, you fat. Oh! So the first one's Napoleon Dynamite. Napoleon Dynamite was uh, a strange, a splendidly strange movie. This is so good. This one is, this one's my favorite one. I, I tried showing that to my kids a couple weeks ago and they just couldn't take it. Yeah, my, I mean, my teenagers, they're just like, Dad, this is just too weird. Is this a home movie? You know, it's like, <laughs> I loved it. Still love it. Hockey and flying V. Hockey skills and a flying V. Now, um, oh shit, you know a lot? You're talking about hockey with a hockey and a flying V guitar. I can tell you with confidence, I haven't seen this movie. I didn't say guitar. Oh, he didn't say guitar. Oh, 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 oh. Wait, 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 wait. There's a formation. It's the flying V formation. There are not very many hockey movies. <laughs> That's true. This is like slap shot. <laughs> There's uh, Mighty, Ducks. Mighty Ducks. My favorite Mighty Ducks. H E double hockey sticks. Okay, so is it Napoleon Dynamite Ducks? <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Mighty Ducks. Napoleon Dynamite Ducks. Yeah! Napoleon Dynamite Ducks. <laughs> That's really good. Napoleon Dynamite Ducks. Yeah, got it! <laughs> Napoleon Dynamite Ducks. Yeah, Grace got it! I got it! Hell yeah! <laughs> Damn! Yeah, that's really good. Yo, that's such a good. That's a great one, Joe. So good. Isn't that nice? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what? If if I'm gonna start watching movies um, that I haven't seen, at the top of my list is is uh, Mighty Ducks, or maybe it's that other Emilio Estevez movie, Men at Work. Wow! How do you know Men at Work? <laughs> I just have a list of movies that I haven't seen that I want to see, and that's the top. 
Men at work. work. That's so <laughs> <laughs> You guys destroyed the, the video game or the movie movie. Now we're gonna move on to round two or whatever this thick thing is. Uh, video game movie game. Gonna give you a couple prompts of video game movie game. Okay. All right. Wait, so does this mean that there's video games and movies? It's a video together. game title mixed with a movie title. Got it. Okay. From downtown, he's on fire. With that United States funded firearm that is specifically for very accurate long distance combat. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. Basketball video game. I remember watching friends play it. They have big heads. And it was like just a couple of them on the court at once, and it was called Hoops. Um, so is that NBA Jam? Is it so NBA Jam? It sounds like you're talking about NBA Jam. NBA, NBA Jam. Jam. So the name of the movie is the name of a weapon, a nationality, oh, and a occupation. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. What's a long distance gun? Bazooka. Bazooka. <laughs> NBA Jam Bazooka. Jam Bazooka. AR-15. Sniper. A sniper. What? What is? So some kind of sniper gun movie? Jam. Jam sniper. Sniper rifle. NBA Jam. NBA Jam. M M M M M M M. Jam. Jam. What starts with jam, though? NBA Jam. It goes with jam. Jam. Amer. Is it some kind of American thing? <laughs> Amer. Amer. American. Is it NBA Jam American? Uh, NBA Jam. Jam American. Uh oh. 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 Okay. Oh God. What is it? Is it? <laughs> is it NBA? Wait, 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 wait. Is it NBA Jim? <laughs> okay, hang on. Uh, hang on. Is it? Work it out. NBA Jam Jammer Jamaican Sniper. Oh, 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 got it. Okay. <laughs> American. Oh, oh, wait, no. NBA Jam American Sniper. Yeah! <laughs> NBA Jam American Sniper. Yes! Wow! Yes. <laughs> wow! NBA Jam American Sniper. <laughs> wow. <laughs> you want me to say it, Joe? NBA Jam American Sniper. Yeah! <laughs> I, I actually don't. NBA. I, <laughs> NBA Jam American Sniper. Da, 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 da. <laughs> I was helped in zero way. NBA Jam American Sniper. Ah, yes, you did it! <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is so. This is this is. Uh, uh, I need a shower. That one really jams in your mouth. That one is like a ten-car pileup in the mouth as it comes out. <laughs> I was thinking American Sniper, but I was just like, wait, uh, like that doesn't fit with jam. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna make people sweat so hard. <laughs> <laughs> All right, last two. These are the TV show movie okay, games. Okay, I'm back in. You're back. <laughs> what is that? Is that your wheelhouse that you're currently in? Because I see it. <laughs> Excuse me. If we start rolling down the street, I might as well be in a trailer because this is my wheelhouse. Got it. Here we go. This is my. This is where this I. This is your I money. Got it. You your money. Need, you don't need to. You're coming in from downtown. A frantic felt frog maintains a hectic variety television program before finding himself in the Big Apple after once again being left behind by his inept vacationing parents. Okay, so we've got... Uh, uh, that's the Muppets, but... Muppets take Manhattan. Right? No. All right, so the first one is how to lose a guy in 10 days. <laughs> <laughs> What's the two left? Uh, Home Alone. Home Alone. Uh. <laughs> the Muppets. It, uh. Wait, I actually don't know. Uh, I don't know the name of the Muppets. Was it not? You, just, you literally just said it. What is the Muppet Show Alone? Two, Lost in New York. <laughs> yeah, there it is. 
<laughs> the Muppet Show Malone? <laughs> what is the Home Alone 2? Home Alone 2. The Muppet Show Malone Part 2. Lost. That's not the net. You don't you put part. You say that again. Uh, say the, the whole thing. The Muppets show Malone to Lost in New York. <laughs> yeah, there you go. You the Muppets show Malone. Finish the title because he was left in New York. I the Muppets show Malone to Lost in New York. No! The Muppets show Malone to Lost, Lost in New, New York. York. <laughs> the Muppets show Malone. Lost in New York. Yeah, there you go. You got it. Trump's greatest work. The Muppet Show Malone. But he was left again. Oh. This time in New York. The Mu Oh, really? Kevin got left again? <laughs> I like the show Malone because it really just feels like Shalom. That's good. I like that. I like that one. You know I like that one. Well, the Muppet... The Muppet Show Home Alone 2 is not an answer. Oh, it is. Well, that's my Put it answer. together. Say, Say it together. together. The Muppet Show Home Alone 2. Yeah, there you go. You got it. There's a colon lost in New York, but you were never going to get there. <laughs> Guys, thank you for watching the episode. If you're interested in the at-home version of this game, we are in the final days of our Kickstarter. Hit the link in the description. It'll take you there. It'll tell you everything you need to know. We've got a base pack. We've got expansion packs. We've got video game, movie game, and TV show movie game. Uh, if you're interested in all that stuff, click on the link. Go check it out. Share it with your friends and family that love movies or TV or video games or card games or just having a good laugh. All of that is available over on the Kickstarter. Thank you for your support. Uh, thank you for watching the video. And I hope you have a safe and happy holidays. Uh, I want to thank you guys. Um, I This was not my strongest round. I have no doubt that everyone else that... That means everyone else probably did worse. So I want to, you know, give a shout out to them. I'm really sorry what you guys had to go through. Oh, yay! <laughs> Good job. You killed thank it. You. Oh, man. This is so fun. Thanks for thank having us. us. Always, what a great way to start a Monday. Yeah, pretty proud of myself. I want to thank everyone for their, uh, their support for constantly yelling the answers that you knew well before I did um, at the screen you know it's uh, you got your you got your workout today I got you a, a warm-up prompt because I was like okay I want link to go in it with a little bit of confidence so I went in and I googled what are links favorite movies and there's a list <laughs> yeah 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 we did a podcast on this I actually found it. So I'm going to give you a uh, just a gimme here real quick. 